couch to something I think a little bit more serious, Social Media Week. It's one of the world's leading multifaceted events dedicated to social media and technology. Uh, it makes its highly anticipated debut in Johannesburg from the 22nd to the 26th of September. Social Media Week Johannesburg will channel established and emerging South African voices to put a localized spin on the global theme, the future of now, always on, always connected. Here to tell us all about Social Media Week is writer, poet, blogger, media consultant, producer, columnist, Destiny Man editor, the list goes on. It's a man who has his own website, he's on Twitter, he's on LinkedIn, WordPress, Tumblr, Facebook, Instagram. He sits on the Social Media Week advisory board. Should I even, I, by the time I've gotten to your name, I've run out of breath. Kojo Bafu, it's good to have you. Welcome Thank to Morning you Live. Me. You know, I mean, it sounds like you live your life online. Is it true or is it um, just... I don't actually live online. I have had moments where it felt like I lived totally online. But I've always been fascinated by the space. I've always been fascinated by technology and, and fascinated by the net. So generally, whenever something comes up, I try it at least once. Yeah. So I have profiles for everything, um, but I use a limited number of them. Okay, so you're not, you, don't, you don't actually have active profiles in absolutely everything. Because, I mean... There's no time. I, I find it very difficult to run an Instagram account, a Twitter account, a Facebook account, um, and still have a life at the same time. It's almost impossible. Well, it's, it's, about, it's about how you approach it. So, I mean, because I'm in the media space, I tend to approach, I tend to approach a lot of that stuff that we're saying I'd approach editorial for anything. So different platforms, you know, different platforms relate to different things, and, and you engage with different platforms in different ways. And so what I'll do is, you know, there's certain platforms I'm not actively on, you know, every single day. And there are others where I'm a bit more regular with it. Yeah. So something like a Twitter, you can be a bit more regular with a Twitter. Whereas Facebook, um, because I run a Facebook page, I don't, I mean, I'm not on there as much as I would be on, on Twitter. Yeah. I mean, the interesting thing for me is what's fascinating me right now is LinkedIn. Yeah. And, and just kind of how you can use that to build a career, to build a business relationship, etc. Yeah, which is very powerful. It is a very, very mm. powerful tool. Let's talk about the Social Media Week because it is highly anticipated. Yeah. Um, what can we expect? What, what's going to happen during this week? Well, you know, it, 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 interesting because they did ask me to be, be on the advisory board and, and, and part of that role is kind of just kind of giving ideas and giving direction and giving thought around, around the things that can be done. But the beauty of it is that it's really open to, it's open to people, so anybody can kind of submit an idea for an event. Um, I'm, doing, I'm, I'm possibly doing a talk around content because that's, that's kind of my area of interest. But I think what it'll be is, is a wonderful snapshot of social media, how it's being used, how it's being used in the country, how it's being used globally, and what can be done with it. Yeah. And I think we'll get, we'll get this kind of broad range of voices and perspectives, and, and that's what I'm looking forward to. So I see that it, it's happening in different countries yeah. and main cities around the world, all at the same time. Yeah, so I think, in, I think it's about 20 different countries sure. at that time. Wow. Um, the first one, the hap first one happened on the continent was in Nigeria, was in Lagos, and that happens, that happens I think around March, so it's, it's, it's been running for about two years now. Yeah. How does South Africa match up to the rest of the world in terms of social media? We, I s threw out a figure a bit earlier saying that we've probably got about 5.5 million Twitter users here in South Africa. Is I that about, about right? I think it's about right. And I think also we, you know, we tend to be the highest on, on the platforms across the continent. Yeah. Um, for me, social media, too often we kind of become beholden to the platforms. So too often we talk about, you know, how many followers you have on Twitter, or how many, you know, how many likes you'll get for something. I think for me the most important aspect is, is what you're using it for mm. and, and y how you're using the tool. So it is interesting that I think South Africa does lead the way, yeah. but to a certain extent also it's how people are starting to use, use the tool a bit more, with a bit more quality, if I can say that. Yeah. In, in terms of? The content that's being in terms of the know. content, in terms of the functionality, in, you know, in terms of what you use it for. You know, for example, a small business. If you have a small business and you're using Twitter, Facebook, etc., to build your business, yeah. For me, the important aspect is the content you're putting out and how that relates to how that relates to your business. So you could you could very it's a, it's a gradual process and it's work, but 
in terms of positioning yourself in your particular industry and your, your expertise within a particular industry, that's what you can use social media for. Yeah, it's the biggest brand building tool out there. I mean, before you, you were reliant on other people doing it for you. Now you can do it yourself, but you can also ruin yourself. Yeah, that's and that, that's the reality. That's, and I think that's people, the people need to be very aware that what you put out there stays out there. Absolutely. I mean, I joined, I joined Twitter 2008 and watched a lot of people come onto it. And we, see, we tend to forget that what you, you, know, what you put out there stays out there. Mm. But just as, just as easily, in fact, it's a lot harder to build, to build a brand, build a reputation, build a positioning with social media than it is to absolutely ruin it. And yeah. I guess that's the case with life. It is. So, you know, social media for me is an extension of life. It's an extension of, of the society we have. Yeah. And it's just another space that has the potential to potential to amplify whatever it is you do. I mean, when we were growing up, if you messed up, if, and I was with you and I messed up and I did something stupid, literally it's the two of us, and then years later you may, tell, you may tell the story, ah, oh, coach, I did, did this the one day. Yeah. Nowadays you mess up and it goes to, it can go to a million people At, just like that all over the world. Within a minute. I mean, it just, within a second, you know, you don't. I, I get amazed sometimes that I will put a tweet out, and before I've even almost push the send button, it's already been retweeted. I'm yeah. like, really? How did you do that? You know, that just shows you that this is, it's immediate, it's powerful, Absolutely. it's out there. And some people are looking for that moment of fame. Um, and that's the reality, is that it literally is a moment of fame yeah. because you'll trend for that little bit and then you're gone, but in every sense of the word because you can put something out there that you think, ah, you know, it's, it's, it's great to share, but mm. I mean, it's like we say, it is as much as it's powerful, it can be one of the most dangerous things. Absolutely. Are you going to talk about the dangers of it at this, at this tweet? Yes, I mean, I, I, think, I think it's important and, and, I, and I'm sure there'll be different people because different people come at it from different spaces. And from what I find one of the greatest, the greatest weaknesses is that people look at social media and find, you know, they, they perceive their value as coming from social media. Mm. So, you know, I'm, I'm a relevant person because I have X amount of, of followers. followers. Yeah. And like you're saying, because everything is so instant and you're literally, you know, you put out a tweet today and it could go to a million people and five minutes later, nobody's really concerned yeah, about, yeah. about you or your existence. Absolutely. If, if you look for validation in spaces like that, um, it can, you know, it can break you. Absolutely. And this is just one of the topics that will be uh, spoken about at Social Media Week that's going to be happening in September on the 22nd to the 26th. It has become an integral part of our lives, of our future. Uh, talking all things social media, Koja, thank you for joining us here thank on the program. Having... Now, Social Media Week uh, would like to um, extend an invitation uh, for you to get involved by helping to design Johannesburg's first ever Social Media Week experience. So submissions for event ideas and speaker opportunities, they run until the 18th of July. How you do that? Well, here we go. It's as simple as visiting www.socialmediaweek.org. All the details will be there. You can be a part of it. And perhaps you've got a great idea that you feel can be used during this particular week. Go there, visit it, and put your idea forward. Let's take a break. We'll see you after this.